Hello, welcome to Geology Life and Healing. This is Sebastian Moyapasa from Tucson, Arizona, um, uh, United States. And this time we're going to talk about five characteristics of gold deposits of uh, Cortez District carbon type. Disclaimer. All the information uh, that has been uh, presented in this presentation, it's uh, educational purpose only. And anything that is confidential and private information that belongs to the company that I work before or I'm working right now is going to be protected. So with that, we can go, uh, go and see the second slide. In this slide, we, we see the uh, Western uh, United States and then we see the uh, current town location. We have this current trend. And uh, there's a uh, Battle Mountain uh, Eureka uh, trend in the Cortez district. Yes, it is at the, at the middle. And uh, important, this source of the information, it's based on uh, um, the uh, publication of uh, uh, Society of Economic Geology, special publication, 17 pages, 403, 413. Uh, title is Gold, uh, gold Rush Less Lessons Learned from the Latest Gigant Gold Deposit Discovered in Nevada. And, uh, uh, by Kevin Creel and Mark Bradley. And uh, thank you very much for them and many people uh, who were behind of them. So make, it was made it possible to have uh, uh, this publication so we all can enjoy it. So ready for uh, for the tour, we're gonna use this uh, Google Earth to put a carling Nevada and put a search, and it's going to start to uh, locate the carling town. And uh, well, so we can see, we see the I-80, like going to, to California, and we are gonna find an exit. It's uh, going to be a big Huawei, yeah, the big Huawei go, uh, going south, and we're going to find a Crescent Valley, there's a population in there, some uh, uh, town in there, and just to the front, you know, if we are driving, going to be our uh, left, but um, and, and in the center of uh, this, uh, we have this uh, belt, uh, Cortez Mountains. So this Cortez Mountains, it's in here, and uh, just a, a beginning of uh, uh, at the beginning of 1990s, they are starting to mine gold in this area. So by the, that time, the uh, gold price it was like two hundred dollars. So they mined this bits uh, like uh, over here. It's a uh, like uh, 0.5 miles, you know, but it was narrow, uh, how much, uh, 0.1 uh, miles. You know, there's an, another pit in here, it's a smaller pit, and uh, there's a point, almost 0.2 miles. And later on, and they went over this conglomerate uh, we have in here, um, and they found uh, gold acres, and uh, in this area, it's a very rich area, with, uh, and uh, carbon uh, with gold at the bottom. And later on, they continue exploration and they found this uh, pit now. And we can see from here to uh, somewhere in there, it's going to be something like uh, 1.7 miles and the other side there, this one is going to be like 1.5 miles. See, and then, they found another deposit, uh, very nice and big in size. And uh, over here, it's uh, going to be 0.8 miles. There's another small pit in there. And in 2012, that's the report that's uh, referring to the publication in Gold Rush. Gold Rush, is, it was uh, this from here, somewhere in there, some in the limits over there. That's like, uh, 2.4 miles and here to there maybe uh, if I can it's going to be like five miles you know long so with that we are ready for um, this uh, five characteristics of uh, Cortez uh, district and let's go back to the presentation you know from here we go over there and 
From there, in the report, uh, uh, in, at the end of 2012, Bors Rush Discovery contained, measured and indicated resources 59.8 million tons um, at uh, 4.35 uh, grams per ton, and inferred resources 39.2 million tons uh, with a grade of uh, uh, 4.53 uh, grams per ton. Number one uh, characteristics of a uh, Cortez district, its uh, gold values are measured in ounces per ton and reported samples 15.4 uh, grams and uh, 35 grams uh, per ton. So number two, exceptional lithology, silurian devenin, uh, mineralized, mineralized limestone and dolomite uh, take uh, up to 2200 feet. Yeah, take better, you know, because this uh, trust falls make it thicker the sections. And uh, number three, uh, mineralization entrapment structures, anticline access, uh, hydrothermal pressure, normal, uh, normal and reverse falls, and main regional Robert Mountain trust fault. Number four, the main alteration associated with gold mineralization is decalcification in two ways: due to silicification of the limestone and dolomites and aridification of the limestone and silty limestone. And number five, the main uh, mineral associated with gold is pyrite, according to this uh, report in 2012. In the size of gold mineralization, uh, I just uh, kept from the pre previous report 28 microns. And uh, if you need uh, some help with the project, with some extra information that uh, I'm not uh, leaving in here, send me an email and uh, I'll send it to you. And uh, I'll, I'll help you as much as I can uh, with your questions and the things that I can answer, of course. Uh, share with a like, and if you don't like it, put dislikes. And uh, thank you very much. Thank you.